The buildings seen in these photographs are clearly built with a function in mind. The main aim appears to be house, to house a lot of people in an area of limited space. It does not look very aesthetically pleasing, however the buildings do fit their function. These pictures again show houses that are built with a function in mind to be residential dwellings. Bourneville, as seen in this photograph, is an example of how houses are built with a function in mind. They were originally built to house the workers that worked in the local factories. As a result of this, all the houses were built in the same style as the same building materials would have been used. They were built quickly and cheaply, and as a result, they are built in terrace rows to get maximum uses of space whilst also being cost effective as exterior walls are shared. Bourneville needed to house the workers that worked in the nearby Cadbury factory. The owner of the Cadbury factory wanted to create an area of low density work workers' houses, so he decided to place all the houses. 20 metres back from the road, creating gardens. This can be seen clearly in the picture above. This is not a typical factory village, as to live here you did not have to work in the Cadbury factory. Previously the function of the village was to house workers for local factories, however today the area has been redeveloped and now the main function is residential houses. This photograph looks like shops. Function wise this is very useful for the local people living in the residential houses around. This is an example of how function can be used to suit a purpose. This photograph is again of a shop, however the Tudor building style does not look like a stereotypical shop. Both these shops are very functional as they are surrounded by residential houses in Bournebrook. Bournebrook has become a popular student area due to its close proximity to the University of Birmingham. However, this is not its original function. The majority of buildings were built between 1918 and 1914. This type of housing is known as by-law housing. Originally, Bournebrook and Celliac were prime locations for working class families. However, over, these, however, over the years, and as the University of Birmingham has expanded, the function of these houses has changed to student dwellings.